Good afternoon. Thank you for joining us for the daily office for noonday prayer here at Christ Episcopal Church in beautiful Albemarle, North Carolina. O oh God, make speed to save us. O oh Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. And I would like to offer today's prayer in memory of Richard Allen Delancey, departed this world on this day in 1990. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen and alleluia, for life will live. Sisters and brothers, our appointed psalm this morning will be Psalm 126 on page 782 of the Book of Common Prayer, or on the Venite app if you're following along on your device with us. When the Lord restored the fortunes of Zion, then we were like those who dream. Then was our mouth filled with laughter and our tongue with shouts of joy. Then they said among the nations, the Lord has great, done great things for them. The Lord has done great things for us and we are glad indeed. Restore our fortunes, O Lord, like the watercourses of the Negev. Those who sowed with tears will reap with songs of joy. Those who go out weeping, carrying the sword seed, will come again with joy, shouldering their sheaves. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. If anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. The old has passed away. Behold, the new has come. All this is from God, who through Christ reconciled us to himself and gave us the ministry of reconciliation. Thanks be to God. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Lord, hear our prayer and let our cry come to you. Let us pray. Almighty Savior, who at noonday called your servant St. Paul to be an apostle to the Gentiles, we pray you to illumine the world with the radiance of your glory that all nations may come and worship you, for you live and reign forever and ever. Amen. Let us now bring our own needs and intercessions before the Lord and ask for his indulgence, his mercy, and his forgiveness. Remember us, O Lord, as we come into your kingdom. As we move through the world, show the world you move through us. Keep us faithful to your teachings and never let us be parted from you. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. We hope you have a beautiful, wonderful, restful, and successful day. As uh, some of us are on vacation this week, some of us are at work. God bless you. Thank you for joining us here at the daily office for noonday prayer. Remember, leave the world a better place this evening. We found it this morning.